I am Dr. Hildegard Batayolo Madalak, formerly the City Health Officer in Kansas City. I joined the force in July 16, 2008 and retired in 2018 because of its forced retirement. I am Councillor Sheila Tabanao, a third termer as City Councillor. During that time, 2016, it was my first term as City Councillor and I was the Chairman Committee on Health. pained me and it surprised me to discover that Cadiz has many TB patients. I am from Cadiz City and it hurt me to know that uh, many of my uh, Simanwa Cadizinos are plagued with TB. You know? For every 10 patients that I see, at that time, 5 to 6 almost had the diagnosis of TB. We are so fresh and have so much advocacy for health as chairman. So TV program of Doctora was launched because of the uh, policy that I made as legislative chairman of the city council. If we have a policy at least, and we can fund, we can have funding for it, at least on our part, even if the national cannot meet our needs, now we have unmet needs in the TB program. The city government in Cadiz at least can help provide more medications. We were very fortunate that we have a doctor for our mayor, Dr. Patrick Escalante, and his heart was all for health and the medical needs of the people. He was very supportive of the program. Sa TV, I think the program, for me ha, personally, if they see that the doctor and the staff are really with them, sympathize. Oh, uh, really sympathize. with them in their condition and, in, and, uh, no, and, and really sympathize with them, and uh, they see the efforts that we make to really reach out to them and help them and assist them, there's no reason for them. I don't think uh, they will, you know, kindness is always effective and infectious and they respond to kindness. And everything you do, you have the passion and the compassion because it's from the heart. The service is not only obligatory work, but it's from the heart. So that's most effective because it radiates in your life and to the people. I promise to be always government worker at heart, especially in TV because the lungs are closer to my heart. I'll always be working for TB. In fact, I started it. Now the concern for TB, it's now with my daughter, who's the, currently the TB coordinator, medical coordinator. And it's also with my son, who is also the TB community nurse. We're all working for TB. I still see patients, families, friends in my church. I encourage them to visit the city, the, 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 the barangay. I always channel them to the barangay, you know. Being a former government worker, they can still trust the government, you know. Who else will help them? Who else has the resources to help them? They just have to be patient. And then I have always encouraged the staff to be, you know, open and friendly and to be supportive. As a counselor, as a city servant leader to the people of Cadiz City, I will continue to help and push through and support the city health office and the government regarding health, advocacy, and also the program of healthy lifestyle with love and compassion to all the people, especially the TB patient. The government is here to help them and support the resources that is given to the department health or the city health office.